Hey family, what's going on? Klaus here, and thank you so much for tuning in, because today we are playing Three Kingdoms Epic War. Guys, thank you so much for watching, and thank you so much to HR Game for sponsoring this video. Guys, Three Kingdoms Epic War is a brand new strategy game that's being released in English on April 11th or somewhere around there. Of course, there's always the uh, possibility of something going wrong, but guys, this is, a, this is a fun game. I've been playing it for the past day or so, and just checking out what it has for me and of course the tutorial is is amazing so like if you do decide to play the game and i recommend that you do check out the link in the description to download and to play uh because it's it's a lot of fun there's a lot to the game basically what you are you are the lord of a city but you don't begin in your own city by the way these green squares this is where you can build your own thing you know i've actually built um i built a market and i built a uh a mine in soulstone mine so you know you you can kind of uh customize your place but you don't start as the leader this is me by the way top left hand side of the screen um you don't start as the leader of this city you actually start as like just this little dweeb basically and, and you you kind of work your way up it's pretty awesome so this is actually where you begin here at luo um luo yang and of course you know by selecting where you want to run you get your character and you run from one position to the other now you don't have to do it this way this is the storyline but it's kind of fun you know like your um your aunt's right here she owns the pub so you can like drop into the pub and hang out with people and recruit heroes and yes guy that's right guys heroes is what this game's all about we're gonna put them to the test we're gonna battle with them here shortly uh but guys it is a lot of fun messing with the different heroes i mean like you saw this guy way to hey he is my tank as you can see he's, he's a panda anybody that has a panda is probably a total beast he's, he's a tank as you can see here by the spear point also all the numbers and statistics are over here i'll let you guys look at that if you want but the most important thing is his level he's level nine and he's a three star so he's kind of like a middle of the road type of hero now we have this guy who's my second in line young sun kwan he actually is your you know, you, you, you meet him going into the... You'll see. If you play the tutorial, you'll understand. He's in the storyline. This guy's level 11, actually. I probably need to uh, level this guy up, actually. Yeah, I, I definitely need to level up. So I'm going to hit the up arrow. I'm going to hit the max level. And these soul stones will be used to max them up. And he can go to a certain level. Also, you can have gear that you use. Um, if you get his soul stones, you can use those to unlock passive skills. You can do a lot of things. It's not super complicated, though. Because, like I said... The two, ooh, my power went up. Uh, the tutorial is really nice, but anyway, these are my characters. Um, Zhang Lang is, is sort of like my middle of the road here, and then we have the art. Oh, oh, that one's cavalry. Look right here. There we go, cavalry. And then we have Bu Lan Shi. She is an archer, and then of course we have Lu Zun. He is a four star, by the way. He's a beast, a gold four star, and he is also an archer, uh, long distance shooter. So these are my guys. I've accumulated them over time. So if you guys um, you know, you go into recruit here, normal recruitment and diamond recruitment. If you have diamonds, which you can purchase using, uh, you know, real money here. If you want to get ahead in the game, you can look at look at this. This is crazy. Over six thousand diamonds for ninety nine dollars, and you get well. If you go over here, you get um, you, you get to uh, get free. Basically, you get to recruit for only ninety. So you have six thousand. That's like over a hundred chests that you could technically open up. But yes, let's go ahead. I get a free. So, whenever you open these, or whenever you decide to recruit, you get to choose one. It's kind of cool. So, I'm going to choose the second one from the I left. I you rather than Chow Chow, my lord. And there you go. He actually talks to you. That's pretty cool. So, yeah, you get a little bit of information. You also get shown what you actually missed out on. So, we got the best one. This one's a three star. This one's a two. This one's a one. And this one's also a two. So, we had the... We we got lucky and we chose the Bao best Xi, one that was an option. At your command. This guy's cool. I like his armor. All right. So, anyway, I'm going to go through. I'm going to... Um, kind of recruit as many Please as I can just because the rebels with me my lord they they all really help out and even if you don't oh I missed that on this guy he's a three um so um, getting these is his helpful my not only is Gaolan. I will or, uh, for forever, fighting my lord but also if you decide to you can actually break down the card and get resources out of it so I'll do that right now after I, I want to join you and fight for you my lord I've already seen you before I've already seen you. Yeah, we got a 2-2 two, two and a... Ooh, a 3. Oh, I missed that guy twice. Dang it. All right, anyway. So now that I've done all my free ones, um, if you have a silver coin, which you get by going out and doing battles and stuff, then you can recruit using the silver coins. But I don't have any. So anyway, um, diamond recruits. Let's go ahead and do a diamond recruit. I've got 300 diamonds. So let's go ahead and choose one of these. This one should be better. I finally escaped. Please let me join you, my lord. All right, so there you go with a 3-star. Uh, obviously, you know, you have a better chance of getting really good ones. But it's a 3-3 three, three, and a 3 
Whoa, I'm what happened? at your disposal, my lord. Hey, this guy. I already have this guy. Why do, why do I have him again? He's a sniper. That's pretty cool, though. Anyway, so yeah, so by uh, 180 uh, diamonds, you can get even more of these guys. Now, again, I wanted to explain how you can basically recycle these cards. So what I do is I go in, there's a star count, one, 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 one. So you can go in, you can recycle all these ones and these twos for resources. And I'm not going to recycle the three, and I'm definitely not going to recycle the four just yet. But, you know, you we can get 17,000 of these copper coins, and they come in handy. You need those for pretty much everything that you do. So there you go. Recycle those car the cards, and now we're good to go. So a lot of talk about these heroes, but they're kind of a big deal. Now, if we go into the pub right quick, we're going to enter the tavern. Um, then you can see, like, there's heroes all over the place. And this guy's glowing. I'm going to click him. Uh, Wan Shu. Okay. Hey, cool. So um, as you play the game, you also get drinks. And so if you toast with these guys, each drink has a different amount. So, like, to get this guy, you need to give 120 points in um, in drinks. And so, like, this this one is 50. I only have, well, I have zero of those, so I don't have enough. Actually, I don't think I have enough to get him at all. Let's just try it. One, two, three, four. That gets us to 80. And, oh, I've got plenty. Until next, wait, wait. No! Oh, I missed him! I've never done that before. He, he got tired and left. I guess I gave him too many drinks. <laughs> he decided to go home. That's kind of upsetting. Yeah, anyway, so if you, let's, we need to have a successful, um, a successful time here. This guy looks pretty cool. All right, let's toast with him. Go. Oh. Oh, okay, you can buy the drinks with your, your coins. Okay. I, I don't need to, though. I've got plenty right here. So if I do five of these, I should unlock him. There you go. So I got some soul fragments of that particular character. And this is a way, one of the ways to actually recruit people. So, you know, that's cool. And also, you can go and you can renovate by using the coins and by using the diamonds that you accumulate. The tavern, very good for getting... Uh, warriors and heroes and such also the seven day gala so just like any other game guys as you play the game you can you know claim stuff as you go basically you know, log in sure you know your lord reaches a certain level claim you get you get rewarded for pretty much everything that you do and it's it's cool it makes you feel you know good about yourself <laughs> so that's uh I, I just got a whole bunch of stuff that's pretty cool oh i got would you like to hear a song my lord Okay, yeah, that's that's awesome. She is also a sniper, I think, or or something. It doesn't say sniper. She's a leer, a beauty, and a curse. That sounds about right. But anyway, so if I wanted to, I would go into uh, units and I would choose to replace one of these. But they're all leveled up, and I don't want to mess with mess with my lineup right now. So let's go actually do some fighting, shall we? All right, so let's go into the elite. You unlock that in chapter three, and let's go ahead and do a fight. I want to show you guys what this fight is or how to how to do the fighting so it's actually quite i don't want to say it's simple you have to be paying attention but you have to look at basically you have this grid you can grab your soldiers and move them anywhere so obviously you want to put your heavy hitters on the front to absorb most of the damage you want to put your archers in behind because they have the range and also if you grab this you can zoom on over and look at what you're dealing with looks like we're dealing with five units of spearmen and nothing else so we have the major advantage having archers in this case also let me see if i click off here you can do auto i'm going to turn auto off i actually don't like auto but some of you might you but you can also go to the top view just to see how everything is lining up i like to go back to this view and then also ui you can look at the names if you have the names memorized of your characters or the types and or you can go back to the no 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 i don't want to do that no i clicked the wrong thing uh but so you can change the ui to make it look different i like to be able to show the, the strength because it does decrease as your troops die so all that being said i think i like my lineup uh you know what actually because their line is so wide i'm gonna separate no i'm gonna keep them together because my son character he has a special ability i'll show you guys here in a minute so as you play the two armies combine they they you know they combine and ooh, this is the guy you're fighting so it gives you a little bit of information but these special abilities uh time up Oh, we're gonna get some reinforcements. Thank you, man. You're awesome. I am the Regent Marshal. Are you afraid? I'm not afraid, no. Okay, so as this levels up, boom, it's unlocked. I'm gonna use this ability. It strengthens all my troops, and now we have a much better chance of actually winning. I like to do his ability first, and then I like to use his ability, which makes him specifically stronger. And generally speaking, so far anyway, um, once I do this I can't care particular special much, ability, here it is, boom, it makes him so much stronger, we pretty much always win. But now, I'll I will switch over to time. my, um, let me think. You know, I don't need to heal, we're at 88%, they're at 49, so I'm going to see if I can use a little damage. Time. It does area damage and tons of it too, so there we go, we are, we're doing good. This was an easier battle, generally speaking, um, especially if you have like a magic user in the background. 
it can get a little bit scary. I'm gonna go ahead and use her ability. She does heal, so she does support a little bit, but I think that pretty much we have got this done. Yeah, I'm pretty confident that we're about to win this fight. Yeah, that's it. Cool. All right, and um, so you guys could see we did an elite, as they say, battle, and so we get the spoils, 120 experience, 300 of the copper coin, and, and 10 of these things. So, you know, every single battle is helpful because we get more stuff, and the more stuff you get, the stronger you can make your heroes. The stronger your heroes, the more battling you can do, and it gets even better. And as you actually get stars moving along this line, you unlock chests. So let's see what's inside of this chest. Looks like we got two of the... Kai Wenji Soul Frag, so we have her, so we now have some more Soul Frags. Also, 200 ore can be used for um, for stuff inside your city. We got some Jade, and we got another Silver Coin for recruitment, so awesome. So now let's take this guy on. I want to do at least two battles in this video. Information processing failure. My computer is probably running faster than my internet wants to. That's been a problem I've been dealing with lately, but here we go. All right, so now, ooh, a full army of archers and as you can see here archers are strong against my spearmen but they're weak against my cavalry interesting all right i have not seen this before so what i'm gonna do since my the archers are weak against cavalry is i'm gonna put the cavalry in the front since again it's all archers so and you can see that by the little logo down there so i say we uh jump right in there all right the the cavalry because they move quicker will run way ahead so i'm not sure if Sun's ability is going to work out. Oh, we got more reinforcements. I am the Marshal. Great. Are you afraid? That's not exactly what I needed, but, you know, it's better than nothing, I guess. So, let's use his Dang ability. He'll strengthen everybody around him. And oh, I missed. I missed Zang, but I guess that's going to be all right. Um, I'll make it quick. Now, notice that every single time they do something, they do have some voice acting. Remember, guys, this game was in production for 24 months before it was released. This game's definitely, they, they put a lot of work into much, it. It plays Lord. very smoothly. It's a nice looking game uh, with over 20, as they said, world renowned artists. And the artistry in this game is very, very nice I'll indeed. So I'm a big fan of how much time and effort they put into this game. Let's go ahead no and smack this guy's you. attack and blow up something. There Can't we go. Very, very Any nice. More. So yeah, we're through down 38%. Can't we're at 80%. Any more. Here and I'm sure some of you would find the um, the, the voice acting, you know, really entertaining and fun. Some people might find it annoying, so I'm not entirely sure. I have not looked through the settings yet whether or not it can be turned on or off, but for the sake of the video, I definitely wanted to demonstrate the voice acting. So, let's no go ahead and use this guy's battle again. Destroy that. Things are not looking very great, actually. 59% of... Oh, well, 13. Okay. Yeah. That Damn. ability really helped a lot. Oh, man. Get down, son. There we go. I'm going to heal up again. Now, she automatically heals whoever has the lowest health. So, it's always Can't good to use her ability because she keeps anymore. you on the upper hand. If you lose one, it just doesn't work out very good. So, there we go. 120 experience, 300 copper coins, and 20 cups. That is awesome. So, we're going to go ahead and click through that. We won that. And I like it. I like it. So, you know, you can progress through here. Chapter 1 in the Elite, but in the main storyline, you know, I made it through uh, 3... And I, um, you know, after Elite, I'm sure after you finish off at 1-8, you can move on to the next chapter and so on and so on. Continue to battle out. Oh, obviously, there's a storyline. So if you uh, back out here, if you look up here at the right-hand corner, this is your, you know, it's you're following the long line. So if you click that, it'll send you into the next stage based on the story. And it's a fun story. You can sit there and listen to it, or you can skip it. It is entirely up to you. So, guys, I think we should finish off this video by doing some more recruitment. I've got some, um, I got three of these silver coins. Let's go ahead and open these up and see what we get. You want me we to got fight? A two star. Your generals okay, are fantastic. All dead? I missed out on two threes. Oh, and this guy, a uh, wealthy merchant. He's a one star. He doesn't look like much, but man, he's worth a lot of copper coin. If you get him, you definitely want to get him if you can. Let's try this again. Go with the first one this time. Shahoba at your service. Okay, that's a two star. Darn it. Two, two, and three. Ah, I hate it when I miss it. All right, and the last one, we'll go with the last one. Let's see if what we get. If you don't want me to be a commander, at least let me be an aide. Okay, that is a two star. This one's a three, two, and a three. Dang it, I've never seen Empress He before. Okay, well, didn't, that didn't quite go 100% according to the plan, but hey, everything helps because again, if you go in to your cards and you recycle, then you're able to get a lot of resources just for the cards that you end up getting. So there you go, 5,400 copper coins just like that. And of course, you could probably do more. 
you know, and we have the extra Luzun, but of course, I'd be afraid. Oh, if actually, if you break it down, you get some soul fragments for Luzun. I already have him leveled up and everything, so I probably would want to break this down, but I would want to do a little bit more research before I made that decision, because the uh, four stars, they are very strong indeed. So, um, guys, after all of that, and, and by the way, this game, very complex. There's a lot more to it. There's no way that I could show you guys all of it in one single video. We'll end off where we started. We're going to go back to our our, uh, our city, our Fife, as it says here. F-I-E-F, our Fife. So, or Fief. I haven't figured out exactly how to pronounce that. But, yes, guys, this is the game. Three Kingdoms Epic War by HR Game. It was a lot of fun checking this game out, guys. If you want to see more of it on the channel, please let me know in the comment section. Also, like the video if you liked it. Hit that subscribe button also if you have not done so already for daily gaming videos. And remember to download this game. Again, the link is down below in the description. We'll also try to uh, get the official website and possibly even the Facebook page down below in the description. Check out the games. A lot of fun. And I've been able to get pretty far along um, in just a very short amount of time. It keeps you going. It keeps you interested, especially with that storyline. So um, anyway, it's a lot of fun. Check it out. Remember, guys, that I love each and every one of you. And I will see you all again next time.